yummy, 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 yummy. All right, super quick, super easy. Short, 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 short video. Zucchini, squash, slice it up. <laughs> Pan. I've already cooked one batch, cooking the second batch. Pan. Literally a cap full of your favorite oil. I'm using grapeseed. I would not use vegetable oil. Use avocado oil. Use um, maybe a cap, cap and a half. A little, little less than a cap and a half of your favorite oil. Not vegetable. Um, coconut oil. You can use coconut is the best to me. Um, Coconut oil, grapeseed oil, avocado oil, light, lighter oils, you know, good, good for you oils. Literally, this is a fourth cup, but I'm using less than half of water. And dump in your zucchini and your squash. I wasn't planning on making this video, so I'm just letting you know I'm not prepared. <laughs> Okay, so you got the zucchini, you got the squash, bada bing, bada bum. I am now adding cilantro. Turmeric. This is however much you like. Uh, ground red cayenne pepper. It's not really hot to me, so. Oops. And a couple of grinds of a sea salt, or sea grinds. I don't like overcooking my veggies. So do not cook until they're soggy. You don't want soggy veggies. We're gonna let them steam, and then I'll come back. Maybe seven minutes or so, five minutes, seven minutes. You'll know when they look kind of translucent in the middle a little bit but not overly so so it's been simmering for about that seven minutes I think I'm going to do it a few more minutes because some of these are much thicker than I did with the first batch so they're not quite getting to where I like them so I'm probably going to do a total time of maybe 12 to 15 minutes total time including the first seven I just did. So I'm going to probably do it another seven, but I'm going to stand here and watch it because they're not quite as translucent as I'd like. Some of them are cut much thicker. I cut, I don't know why, but I, I think this was the two um, thicker ends of the uh, zucchini and the squash. So I cut these up there a little bit thicker. I don't know why I did that, but I did. So I'm going to come back and show you when I pull them off um, what they look like. We are done, done, done. Yeah, baby. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Oh, drop one. <laughs> so again, you want it to have a little bit of translucence in the middle. Let me find a good one. It's hot. You want a little translucence in the middle. See how it's not white anymore? But you don't want it to be so translucent that it is mushy. Like this one's a little mushy because it was thinner. That was a little bit mushier. So uh, let me get it dished up. And it's gonna get in my pivot. So hot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. I like it to still have a little bit of a crisp to it, you know? I don't like it to be completely mushy. Nobody likes mushy vegetables. You should not be eating mushy vegetables. Yummy! Mm. 
got a little kick from the cayenne pepper. Can't really overly taste the other spices, but they do add a little something to it. I hope you enjoyed this. Go get you some zucchini and squash and get to saute, steamy, however you want to eat it. And I'll see you next time. Enjoying the videos? Then give a thumbs up, subscribe, share, and comment. Support future videos on Patreon for just a dollar a month and text Vanner Fam all one word to 703-783-3232. I'll see you next time.